Hi, this is Mrs. Nelson. We're looking at Unit 2, Lesson 6, Introducing Double Number Line Diagrams. The objective says, I can label a double number line diagram to represent batches of a recipe or color mixture. A particular shade of orange paint has two cups of yellow paint for every three cups of red paint. On the double number line diagram, circle the number of yellow, numbers of cups of yellow paint and red paint needed for three batches of this orange paint. So you can see we've got some labels right here. So going across uh, horizontally, these represent the number of cups of yellow paint in various batches. We also have a label that's red paint. This uh, going across horizontally shows the number of cups of red paint that we would need uh, with various numbers of batches. When we're thinking about batches, we're going to be looking at that vertical relationship. So we're looking at this representing a batch, this is a different batch, and so on. So if I wanted to make no paint whatsoever, I would use zero cups of yellow paint and zero cups of red paint. So that represents zero batches. I made nothing. If I wanted one batch, then I would use that original recipe. Two cups of yellow paint and three cups of red paint. So that's one batch. Next to it would be two batches or a double batch, three batches or a triple batch, four batches, five batches, and six batches. So this particular question says find the amount of yellow and red paint that you would need for three batches. So not ignoring zero, I would count over one, two, three um, batches, and that would be how much yellow paint and red paint I would need if I wanted three times as much of the orange paint as what I would normally make. The objective says I can label a double number line diagram to represent batches of a recipe or a color mixture. So again, with batches, we're looking at that vertical relationship. Each one of these vertical pairs represents an equivalent ratio for the original mixture recipe. Thanks for watching.